Hey everyone, this is EG Braden CM, and I'm going to be going through my uh, basically my loot route here on uh, Earth. So the very first one is easy: hit the caves, quick and easy. Then I can just kind of do a, a check the perimeter. What we're looking for here is spin metal, obviously chests. They like to hang up on this back wall up there quite often. Both chests kind of right above the concrete, and also spin metal in between the. I guess the, the pillars or, or foundation, whatever you want to call it. Um, also, sometimes I, f I see one right behind there or down here at the very end. So sticking with that on this kind of half of the, the level, this tiny little hut here, uh, sometimes you'll find one right at the very top. You should check it out. I don't really see anything here. Then also on top of this building, that's, oh, wait, nope. There we are. Um, often there'll be one in the that corner just there right over there. And then drop down and then go underneath. Now down here, there's always some. So check this back room. Uh, it's not a very common one, but uh, it could happen down here as well. And then what you want to do is go to the, the dark area. Go downstairs. Now in here, it's dark. You have to, the flashlight will, of your little uh, ghost will turn on to check things out. Just check this side room. Once again, just like the one upstairs, it happens occasionally. Back here, I don't really see it too often, but it's mainly this dark area where you're going to see them. Now it's dark, so you're going to have to check very carefully. Check all the corners, check the roof, the ceiling, every little nook and cranny for that green light of the chest. Uh, you might miss it, so you have to be quite thorough when you're examining each aspect. I kind of check the f check the top. Once I'm good with the top, what I'll do is I'll jump down and check the, the bottom, which is usually where stuff are. Sometimes you get them on this little shelf right there so just hop down here and uh, there's a couple places um, this little back little corner there underneath the stairs as well so far for video this isn't a really good example of the loot one um, on a good day usually one run of the route will get me I don't know eight to ten pieces of spin metal which is great so in here you do have some level 18 uh, enemies so heads up if somebody's not 18 you heck, even 18, you're going to be there a little bit. Um, just be aware of that. There's only, uh, I think it's four, one knight and three of his little buddies. So clear them out, and then you'll be able to check this back room back here. That's all you're really checking. Uh, sometimes there's one around the corner. I see one right here. So there's one right there. Wait for my my colleague to come. No, he doesn't want it. Okay, I'll, I'll grab it. And then that's all for this room. So continue down into the, the dark area. And once again, you got to check the corners. You can see the green light up here. Now this one's probably the toughest to get, the one that's stuck in between, just because it's really you can't really jump up there from either of the sides. As you can tell, there's some metal. You can hit on the concrete, but you're not close enough to actually open the loot itself. So what you have to do is you swing around, and uh, Titan, you're able to flo float as well. But you basically have to float there in your jump long enough so you can actually open the chest open and get the loot so what you want to do is just kind of come up underneath it halfway and kind of hold it till you get that one and hope that you're you're there quick enough so you can actually open it there we are other than that most of the chests are pretty straightforward and easy to get Besides that one. That one is just a little bit of a trick. So if you don't have that hover ability, you might be there for, for a little bit just to uh, figure it out, basically. And what? then after that, you go back upstairs to this back one. You're going to be on the other side of the this starting area. So then just check this cave. So far, this, uh, this roundabout hasn't been very good. That's for sure. Check along the edges for the spin metal, just like the spin metal up here. And uh, then, then once you're done that, we're, we're back to the start. And that's the whole loot so run. So if you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching.